Yo, what's good guys, and welcome back to more Pokemon Brown. In the last episode, we got ourselves our final gym badge in the at uh, Yeah, we got, our <laughs> we got our final gym badge in the at uh, e City Gym. Well, I can barely say that. In the Yaglu City Gym. And in this episode, we are going to be taking on the first member of the Pokemon League. But before we do that, we have to get to the Pokemon League, which is why we're here in Jeru City. Anyway, off screen, I did a hell of a lot of grinding. It took me so long. Everything is level 60, though. Hopefully that is good for the Pokemon League, but yeah, there's no real place to train in this game, and, uh, I was grinding in, like, uh, Castro Valley Forest and stuff for hours to get all my Pokemon up to 60. It just took me a long time, but it's done. We're hopefully ready for the League, and hopefully stuff goes good. Alright. Anyway, guys, if you are hyped for the first member of the Elite Four, go ahead and drop a like and a comment. I'd really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah. Gotta go through all the Pokemon League stuff. Hopefully it's not a victory road. I really, really don't feel like doing a victory road right now. I just wanna, just wanna get to the Pokemon League, take on the first member, win, and then, uh, finish up, pretty much. I just wanna get stuff done really quickly today. Alright. So we were up here before, and uh, we went past the first person, we didn't go any further because I didn't feel there was any point. And, uh, yeah, I guess we'll do all this stuff here. So we got the Hail Badge, the second gym badge, I think that's the Awaswari City Gym, I think that was where it was. Next up was, um, I don't even remember, Sparky Badge, I guess I got the badges in the wrong order. I think I got the Moraga Town Badge first, and then I got the Jeru City Badge. I actually remember the towns, which is kind of funny. Yeah, this is the uh, Moraga town, I think. Uh, then we got ourselves the Castro Valley Gym Badge. Then was the, uh, I keep forgetting it, I think it was Seashore City, or wherever, like, our town, the, where we started off was, that's where we got our next Gym Badge, the Psy Badge. Then we got the Castro Valley Forest Badge. And then, as I mentioned earlier, the Iagbu City Gym Badge. I actually remembered all the towns. I'm actually pretty happy with that. And we also went to his alley town and beat Bugsy, but we got a Gligar for that. And, uh, yeah, he said that, like, the Johto badges don't count towards the Raijin League. Wait, anyway, well, Firo, uh, not, not too impressed with that, honestly. But you get the star badge, which was the last badge we got. And we are, hopefully here, can interact with that sign. Uh, please, no victory road, I am... I'm just not in the mood, to be honest. Uh, there's a surf spot over here, I wonder if we can surf in it. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> just a little bit, alright, never mind. Oh, I feel like this cave coming up. It just feels like it's coming. I can just feel, I can just feel victory road coming, I, ugh. I really don't want to do one, <laughs> I just, I'm not in the mood. Yes! Yes, there's no victory road! We're just here. We have to face war trainers and the current champion in order to receive that title. Go for it. Right, great. Ah, uh, no victory road. I'm happy. I'm very happy with that. Okay, well. Best for us to stock up on items. I uh, get like 10 hyper potions. That'd probably be enough. Because I already have like 20, I think. And. I'll get like. I don't know how many revives I have, I don't really care about, like, usually I get sort of stingy with the, uh, actually I should've, no, I'm gonna sell some stuff here. Uh, actually, blah, blah, the perfect amount of revives. Uh, I'm gonna sell these max repels, I don't need them anymore, just to buy some full heals, I'm gonna see what else I can sell. Great balls, gone. Uh, that'll get me ten full heals, great, that's what I want. There we go. And, um, yeah. Let's see what we are dealing with here. Uh, do you think you're ready? Good, go in. Shut up. I know I'm ready. Let's do this. Let's do this. This is a very small room, alright. Well, here's the first member of the Elite Four. Let's see what we are dealing with here. Welcome to the Region League. I'm Red, the Fire Trainer. No one can withstand my fire Pokemon. To put it simply, you won't win. Let's see. Let's see about that. Funny how your name is Red, though. I mean, you ain't Red. You're just some red-haired girl who leads off with level 59 Rapidash. Alright. No big deal. Um, I think I'm just gonna go, like, right out into Kathy. 
the Elapras. Pretty much should be able to deal with this thing. Is this... Is this it? <laughs> is that it? Is that it? S growl? Is that it? Really? That's uh... That's what the Elite Four member is packing. A level 59 Rapid Atric Growl. Right. Well, next up you have a Nine Tails. I actually feel like going into Scoop because Scoop did learn Earthquake actually while we were training up. And I also thought it substitute as you guys can see here, but no big deal. We got we got uh we got Earthquake. So we're just gonna destroy this thing with an Earthquake. Probably could have stayed in with uh with Kathy might have been my better bet. Especially, I don't want to really waste Earthquakes, actually, so... Yeah, that'll be the only one that gets Earthquakes, I think. I think we'll go right back to Kathy now. Flareon. Coming in next. It's good that my team, like, matches up really well against Fire-types. Just by the fact that I have, like, a really bulky Water-type, and then... I have a really fast, like... Doug Trio that gets loads of critical hits. Because, again, critical hits are judged by speed in this game. Survive to Surf. And that like super potion heals up 50 HP. That healed up like a really decent amount of HP, considering like that was a rather decent amount. It got back. Must have like no HP. Next up, Arcanine or Arcanine, level 60, using Roar, unaffected. Kathy ain't afraid of no growling little puppy. We're a big sort of like I don't know what is, what is Lapras like some sort of turtle sea monster sort of thing I don't know <laughs> and finally Charizard is the last Pokemon on the team gonna go ahead and stack Shiv the Pokemon we started with or started like this fight with we did start with Mokai the Venusaur and we're gonna drop a thunder and totally destroy this Charizard there we go that is the first member of the Healy 4 defeated really quickly which is good and um yeah you're better than I thought. Go on ahead. And anyway, guys, I think with all said and done, I am going to wrap it up here in the next me <laughs> well, okay. In the next episode of Pokemon Brown, we're gonna be taking on the second member of the Elite Four, and hopefully that will go as well as this one did because this was really easy. So, as always, guys, if you leave a like, if you enjoyed the video, that'd be great. I really appreciate it, and I will see you guys next time. Catch you guys then.